Hello everybody, I'm Frida Stoffer. I just uh, left the dermatologist right now. I have a, um, I had a cyst removed from my face and it's probably a little bit discolored and, and it has two stitches in it. And on this side also, oh, this one might be bleeding a little. I'll probably put a band-aid on when I get home. No, she did put a band-aid. That's a band-aid. <laughs> this one probably should have a band-aid too, if it doesn't get. Oh, I guess the train is coming because this light is starting to blink. But I'm relieved to get it off of my face. Is there a band-aid here? Yeah, there is. <laughs> I can't see because I don't have my glasses on. I can't see things that are close up. I'm glad they covered it because I was working. I was trying not to touch it with my hijab, but um, they covered it with a band-aid. So um, I'm, I'm happy that they removed it. Inshallah, it will, it will heal now and, and be gone. Because this one gave me a lot of trouble. It lasted a long time. And it's been there for too long. And, I just decided to go to the doctor and have it removed. It's been a gorgeous day today, a really gorgeous day. It rained most of the week, over the past week, and today is like the first day. It's not um, cloudy and the sun is shining. There are fluffy white clouds, but there are no rain clouds. <sighs> I got sleepy sitting sitting on that table, and I don't know, maybe the medicine. I don't think it. I don't think lidocaine makes people sleepy, but I sat in in that office, and I always get sleepy in a doctor's office. This cyst was constantly giving me like it was filling up with debris and, and I'd have to squeeze it and it smelled bad. Um, I decided to have it looked at and I'm happy I did because it wasn't fun. <laughs> it wasn't fun at all. I couldn't like even if I sprayed it with peroxide it still kept coming back, it didn't heal. I, tr I used to clean it with alcohol, peroxide, I think it was too deep, and it couldn't reach the, where it needed to go. She put um, a couple of syringes of lidocaine in. She put one and she asked me, does it still hurt? And I said, yes. <laughs> so she put more in. I'm thankful that I was able to get it done. And to enjoy this weather. It's a little warm this afternoon, but this morning it was beautiful. I don't really know the actual temperature now. Oh. Just, I just know it's a little bit warm and the car um, gets scorching hot when it's parked in the sun. get to pick up the kids.
because I had ordered some uh, um, garden um, fertilizer. I wanted organic, but I decided to go ahead with the con uh, with the uh, conventional this time, and then maybe I'll place an order or go shopping and get some that is uh, organic. As because I really want to stick with organic products. I'm not sure if they're 100% organic, but hopefully they're better than uh, conventional, more, uh, more natural. When I used to work at Wegmans and sell produce, uh, sometimes uh, some of the organic salad it could have like a small bug in it. And that was the price you pay for. Uh, that's the, that is the um, trade-off of uh, eating organic, is that you have to look for little tiny critters that escape, that um, someone else missed when, when they uh, processed it in the, in the um, plant, in the, wherever they packaged it. Like, I, I was used to touching it all the time because it, it annoyed me. And now, uh, every time I almost touch it, I think about, uh, wait, I just, <laughs> I better not touch it. It's got stitches. I might bleed if I play too much. Get infected or something. I'm still on augmenting for my, uh, for my leg. When it got infected, the doctor gave me, um, weeks worth and I still have one like maybe a little less than a week but I think it's enough to, uh, to get past this um, facial um, surgery minor surgery they told me I'll have a little line on my face I don't care I say I don't care if there's a little line there but I I just don't want to um, have a smelly Drainage. That's what I'm worried about. Mm -hmm. 
wasn't nice. I didn't like it. I didn't know what to do. I did everything I knew how. lilies it's navy and it has lilies and i wanted it it was 25 dollars or maybe 30 yeah 29 it was 30 dollars oh, let's see if i can open this i like these kind of bags ziploc bags now that they uh, use to package clothing It's a 4X. It's made exactly like the other one I had on that I uh, showed all of you. It has an empire waist and it's made out of that soft material and it's so pretty. It has, you can see these lilies and I, I had that one in my cart for a long time until I got money to get it. And it has long sleeves and it's very long. I love it. This, I'm so happy that I found a style of dress that fits me. Um, I I tried dresses in different styles before and they didn't fit me good, but Empire does fit me, and I'm happy with it. This is the brand Ask Yes, Ask Yes, and uh, Ask Yes Beauty. I like it. <laughs> it's uh, worth. $29 if I if I'm comfortable and it's the whole outfit it's not I don't have to have separate pieces like I don't have to have separate tops and bottoms and all that all right so I got a new another empire waist dress and this one has lilies and it's navy and I really like it it's very nice and very comfortable just like the black and white one I got so I'm excited because I found a style that works for me and it's a one-piece outfit instead of layers 